The program was actually established in January of 2013 and we've had seven graduates um, that um, went through the program and they graduated in May and then we've had we have 11 juniors right now and then we have 24 students that will be applying in the fall for the 2014 class. We actually have uh, three labs on campus. Two are taught in the spring. Uh, one is the diagnostic bacteriology class and they look for organisms, path mostly pathogenic organisms and they learn about the biochemical reactions that we utilize in the laboratory for detection. And then we have a hematology hemostasis lab where they're actually looking at blood cells, identifying normals to begin with, and once they become proficient in that, then we move on to the abnormals and we look at more of the cells that cause leukemia or sickle cell, thalassemia, some or general anemias, um, and that gets them more comfortable. So when they're on internship, they've actually had some hands-on experience before they get to it. Uh, the one that's taught this summer is actually immunohematology or transfusion medicine, and that's actually a course that's taught um, with uh, reagents that have been donated uh, from Immucor. Well, it's required as part of their training that they actually spend time in a real laboratory and do real laboratory work under supervision of some of our medical technologists. So the more experience they, they have, the better. I think it's been a win-win a for both our staff and for the UNF students because our staff has, um, they, they've really enjoyed having the students around and the students have challenged them to really sort of go back and look at things and learn more. And so it's been productive on, on both kinds. The hands-on experience that I've gained in the medical lab has been things that we've learned about in textbooks, but we've learned how to do them hands-on. Um, I've learned how to do things without contaminating myself, without contaminating others. I've learned how to read and interpret the results that I've obtained from doing the procedures that I've talked about in school and performed in the lab. So the hands-on experience has really toned in my skills more than just reading and learning and understanding, which is a very necessary aspect, but to actually perform the skills, to perform what we learn, really reinforces what I've read, but also how to perform it. I've gained a lot of hands-on experience on hematology and hematology, um, chemistry, uh, immunology, and serology and I've been able to actually handle patient samples and perform various uh, high complexity testing and it's been quite uh, insightful to say the least. I feel like uh, the UNF Medical Lab Science Program has prepared me tremendously. There is absolutely a need for medical technologists here in Northeast Florida and also nationwide. There's a shortage the average age of the medical technologist is over 50 in most labs and so we need new blood coming into the labs and the students really give us an avenue for that. Um, the job outlook is good here at Baptist but also at the other facilities that are participating in the training as well. The program was built based on the future of laboratory medicine and we're looking at more of the molecular diagnostics phase and we want to make sure that our students are going to be more marketable than any other students out there. So I'd say that that's the marketing piece of our program is that we really want to make sure that they have a good genetics and a personalized medicine background versus the traditional laboratory medicine. We really wanted them to be prepared for the future.